Hello everyone, welcome to Sir, You Are Being Hunted. This is an open world procedurally generated survival game with a very large dose of humor. It is currently available on Steam Early Access, link to that will be in the description, and is in alpha, so remember that. The game is not finished, but from what I've seen it looks well-rounded enough to have a lot of fun with. Okay, so even though it's called Sir, You Are Being Hunted, I'm going to switch this to Madam. Madam, you are being hunted, for a reason that you'll see in a couple minutes. Alright, let's um, start generating the world, and I will explain more as we go, so... Here's the list of worlds that I have made, which at the moment is none. So, build a new world. So yes, this game is procedurally generated. Every single biome is generated on the... Uh, I was going to say on the fly, actually. No, it's not on the fly. It's generated right here, before you even get into it. There are, what, one, two, three, four, five, so there's five different places. There's the Central Island, and the North, South, West, and East Islands. And each one can be whatever biome you want. I think you can choose from four, right? Rural, Mountain, Fens, and Industrial. Okay, yeah. So, let's just set, let's just set these biomes to the greatest variety I can get. So let's get a Mountain, and let's get a Fens, and let's get an Industrial. And we're back to rural. Okay. Good variety there. So let me start generating the world and I will talk more about what I'm going to do. Alright, it's gonna take a it's gonna take a little while to generate, which is understandable because it is generating everything you are about to play. It has a lot to do. So I'm going to be doing two special things with this playthrough. Okay, number one, I'm going to be doing a self-imposed Iron Man mode. This game does not have any sort of an Iron Man mode in it, but I'm just doing it to myself. So what that means is that when I die, that is it. That is the end of the character's life. I will delete, I, I will not load a save game to get my life back. If I die, I will delete the world that I generated. It's over. That life will be done. I'm doing that to ramp up the, uh, the stress of it. So <laughs> if I die, that's it. So things are on the line here. Yep. Okay, second thing I'm doing is I'm naming each run after a person. So that's why I switch it to Madam You Are Being Hunted, because this is going to be the life of a very British name that I found on a list of very British names on some website. I just copied down a bunch. I think they were taken from a list of, like, BBC credits or something like that. But anyway, the one I picked was Anne Tricklebank. So this is the life of Anne Tricklebank. And again, if I die, if she dies, that is the end of her life. She will be crossed off, and that is it. I hope Anne survives. Alright, it's generating the center island, so we are almost done. And then the intro video will play. Oh, Anne Tricklebank. I hope you survive. Madam, if you can hear this, then the experiment has gone terribly wrong. I fear you may be trapped on the archipelago, but don't panic. The standing stones should be nearby. With them, and some luck, you may still be able to escape. Listen very carefully, and you might just survive. I am afraid pieces of the device are now scattered across the islands. They became quite hot during the experiment, so perhaps you could look for the smoke. Bring any you find back to the Standing Stones, then we should be able to get you home. I'm dreadfully sorry, madam, but this does mean postponing dinner preparations. I do hope you remember to eat something. You must try to keep your strength up. Perhaps some tea and biscuits from one of the nearby houses? The residents won't mind because they're... Well, they're not at home. Oh, and do be careful, madam. You are being hunted. Here we go. Handy survival guide. Distraction. The robots will investigate noise. Use this to your advantage. Okay, here we go. 
Let me just say a couple things before I totally get going, and I'm going to pause it, because otherwise I'm probably going to die. Yeah. Number one, this is a very British game, so I am drinking tea. Mmm. Wonderful. And by the way, I expect you to be drinking tea as well. Seriously, if you're going to watch this video, or play this game, you need to drink tea. I will know if you don't. I will know. What will I do? If I find that you're not drinking tea? Well, let's just say every time something bad happens in your life, you're going to think, is this karma from that one time I didn't drink tea while watching a video on YouTube about Sir, you are being hunted? And do you know what the answer to that is going to be? Maybe. Maybe not. It's a mystery. Seriously, drink tea. You better. I will know. Let's see what else is there. Oh yes, um, I have played this game for like 20 minutes just to familiarize myself with the basics. But it's not particularly complicated to get into it, so... It should be pretty straightforward, everything. Um, I've watched a couple videos of people playing it as well, so I know a little bit. But I'm by no means a master or even particularly good. I just know the basics. I just know what I'm supposed to do. Which is... There's a little, like, mini-tutorial here in the beginning, as you can see. Examine stuff, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, apparently there's been some sort of an experiment. I don't know what we were experimenting with, but... It apparently left me in a place where I'm not supposed to be, and I'm being hunted, and I need to collect a bunch of fragments to get home. So that is my goal. Collect a bunch of fragments. So there's some t tutorial stuff here. Examine with the F key. Yep. Mm-hmm. So just, yeah, you can loot people. That's basically what it's saying. Let's just take everything. Ah, very useful. Now you can observe your pursuers while keeping a safe distance. I believe he's referring to the binoculars. Thank God that loud noise stopped. Whew. So let's just get through this little tutorial stuff here. This is one of the fragments. Excellent. You've found one. Return that fragment to the standing stones and leave it there. You'll be one step closer to home. Yep. Here's the fragment, and as you can see, it is very large. So I have to return the parts to this. A few more of those, and we can activate the device. Okay, so I found one, and as it says down here, there are 24 remaining. At least 24 more needed. And it tells you how many are left on this island. The other islands being the other biomes that you generated at the beginning. So, I need a bunch more fragments. <laughs> I need a lot. This is going to take a long time. Might as well save my progress. I think, I believe the only points where you can save your progress are at the Standing Stone. And also, when you take a boat to go to the different biomes. I think those are the only two points where you can save. Maybe you can save on Exit as well. Maybe, I'm not sure. So anyway, let's um, take a look at what we have. So we have some binoculars. Let me put those in the first slot. That's great. Um, oh yes, I guess I should explain some other things. Uh, so you have visibility here. Stealth is very important. This is a very stealth-oriented survival game. You do not want to fight unless you have to, basically. It's not a run-and-gun game at all. You will die. You have health, of course, and you have vitality, which is basically... It's basically how well-fed you are. So it's going to constantly go down. And when it reaches a very low amount, you'll start to starve and lose health. And you can't... I don't believe you can restore your health directly with, say, like a health potion or a med kit or something like that. However, um, what you can do is eat food to get your vitality to a high amount. And if your vitality is high, if you're well-fed, your health will regenerate slowly. So that's how that works. Um, you can bleed. So you can get shot, and there's a chance that it'll cause you to bleed, in which case you'll need to use a bandage or you will bleed out. So it's a fairly hardcore survival game. Although it does have that strange... It has a very large amount of humor, so it's both kind of hardcore and also ridiculous at the same time. It's a pretty awesome mixture of it, too. It's, it's really cool. So yeah, I have my binoculars, which will be handy. A strange scanner. I have no idea what this is. Let's equip it. <laughs> I love the descriptions. Every, every description in this game is just a joke, basically. It's hilarious. 
Well, okay. Binoculars, adjustable magnification. That's not funny. That's not a joke. <laughs> but this one. Thingoscope. Keys off micro changes in air density. I don't know what that means. A spooky pumpkin. Happy Halloween. I think I can eat this to restore my vitality. Canned pie, eat it. Uh, rags for bandages, great. Empty bottle can be thrown as a noise distraction. An alarm clock can be put down as a noise distraction. And we have some more rags. Just shove those to the bottom. Mm. Let's put these things down there, and I'll put my consumables up here. That sounds good. Yeah. Okay. That is someone hunting me. With a spotlight. I don't want to be seen. And you can see while I've been talking, my vitality has already almost gone down to 75. Also, the sun is going down, which is not good. So let's try this thingoscope. Uh, what? <laughs> what the hell is this? Okay, so it's showing me if I go in this direction. It's pointing me in a direction. Maybe it is pointing me in a direction of another fragment. I know there's a couple ways you can find fragments. Uh, one way is, as I mentioned in the introduction, you can find, like, smoke. Because they're heated up. So that will lead you to them. Perhaps this is another way. I don't know. Never used it. Anyway, at the moment, I have literally no defenses. So, uh, yeah. Should I head in the direction that this is pointing me? I don't know, it's pointing me in the direction of that searchlight. Which makes me a bit uncomfortable. Also, I like how this thing has an infinity symbol on it. wonder what that means. Hmm. Well, come on, and trickle bank. Let's go. Try not to die, because if I die, I'm done. That's the end of the world. And the lineage of Anne Tricklebank will not go on. Oh, also, these little things you see. My binoculars here. Those wisps, or whatever you'd call them. Apparently, they can lead you to another fragment. Or, they can lead you to danger. I don't know. I think it's, I, I'm guessing it's randomized where they lead you. But yes, they can help you, and they can hurt you. At the moment, I'm going to not follow them. Oh, there's a robot. I am being hunted. By robots. You have to be very careful. Oh, hello, birds. Alright, where's it pointing me? This way? Okay, it's actually not taking me to the town. Or this little settlement. It is taking me over here. Shit, did they just spot me? Heard a voice. No. No, they didn't. Okay. Yeah, I gotta keep an eye on my visibility thing at the bottom left. Okay, it's getting bigger. It's getting very big. It's also very dark. Oh, it did point me to it. Look at that. Well, thank you. Oh my. Okay, that's huge. I, got, I can't keep that in my inventory. I gotta take it back. So will it point me to another one? No. I guess that means I'm not near any. Okay, let's take it. Let's take this back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you, where are you going? Okay, okay, good. Look away. Look away. You can, uh, you can loot houses. You can't go inside of them, but you can loot them. If you go up to the door like this. It looks like there's something useful in there. Oh, and if you find anything edible, don't look at it too closely. <laughs> yeah, a lot of the food you find in the houses, um, that is, most of it, is rotten. Alright, we got some more rags, good. A bag of mints. Sweet! Fresh breath, here we come. Small pile of bones, a skull of a sheep. <laughs> what are you supposed to do with this stuff? Alas, a skull, and another skull of a sheep. C can someone explain to me why inside of this shed... There's a bunch of bones. It's kind of creepy. A bunch of bones and a bag of mints, and that's it. This is a strange and disturbing shed. 
But yeah, this weird random stuff, I don't think you can do anything with it. After all, it says junk. So I'm assuming that means it's totally useless. Can I... I can't use... no. Just have to discard it. Completely useless. Okay. Back to the standing stone, which... was this way, right? I think. Is, okay, there it is. Whew. Yeah, how am I going to find the standing stone, actually? Once I leave the area. Do I have any way to get back to it? I don't believe I have a map. Hmm. Excellent. We're making progress. You might survive this, after all. <laughs> we'll see about that. Okay. Well, shall I loot the nearest town? I have no leads on where another part might be. Scout it out. You have to be very patient in the... Oh, yep, you have to be very patient in this game. If you run, if you run and gun, basically, you will die. That's pretty much it. I think if the robots find one of the fragments, they will actually protect it. And they, they just tend to be around the fragments, in general. So you might have to fight for them. Do I really want to go to that town? I don't. Oh, what the... Oh, shit. I did not see that there. That is not good. Wait, wait. It doesn't... It's not... Is it not chasing me? I don't know, but I'm running. Okay, I, I think I'm okay. I think. It might report, like, it might, like, report my location to the nearest robots or something. That's not that big of a deal, though, because I'm in... I'm in cover here. I'm good. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see. Looks like I'm in a swamp. I think I actually am in a swamp. Or... No? No, I guess I'm not. I don't know, it looks swampy. Alright. Nothing. Vitality's low. I'm gonna go ahead and eat. Uh, let's eat a bag of mints. There we go. It freshened my breath and gave me ten vitality. Okay, there's one somewhere over there. I don't hear anyone. That's a good sign. Alright, let's loot this place. I think I'm safe. Oh, by the way, it even has randomly generated names for the towns. So, which one is this going to be called? What is this going to be called? Bishop's Hamlet. Please... Die slowly. Oh, thank you. I love you too. Oh my. There's a lot of crap. Oh, a boiled haggis. That's actually usable. Unpleasant eggs. Dubious unpleasant eggs. Blight-ridden spuds. Old boots. A small pile of bones. Moldy bread and a dead rat. No thanks. I'm good. I think I will eat this haggis. Oh, 98. Vitality. Oh, it's coming closer. Probably should stay away from that light. But I don't think anyone's around to really see me. More crap, more crap. Ah. A jar of marmalade. Delicious. A pipe and tobacco. Wait, why is a pipe and tobacco dubious? How can that be dubious? Is it rotten? You know, what the hell? I'm gonna smoke it. I think that just removed some vitality. Ugh. That was not worth it. Ooh. Wow, I have a lot of bandages. Pickled onions. That sounds... disgusting, actually. 
Oh, whoa. What is this? Mothballs? Nasty weed killer? It's all junk. Ah, whiskey. Excellent. Some cat food. Ooh, that sounds good. It actually improved my vitality slightly. I knew it. Alright, let's smoke this one. Okay, that yeah, that does remove vitality. <laughs> okay. So I'm safe for now. Oh, hello. A large trap. Exotic spices, which are all junk. I'm not exactly going to be doing any cooking. I'm not going to be making any curries anytime soon, that's for sure. Okay, yes, I appear to be safe here. Now, what does this large trap do? Obviously, it looks like a bear trap. I guess I just put it on the ground. I suppose I could place it on the ground and maybe use the alarm clock. A delayed distraction. Maybe use it to attract them to it. Can I, like, equip... Can I... Combine anything with it? I'm not really sure if this game has a crafting system. I don't know. Let's shove it in there. I kind of want to put it down just to see what it does, but I might not be able to pick it up again. I, pr I probably can't pick it up. No, I'm going to leave it. Okay. All right, it's daylight again. Where's that fragment? This way. It's a surprisingly lush game, too. I like it. There's a lot of vegetation. And aside from the vegetation just looking good, it also has a very good gameplay purpose. And that is, to conceal you, tall grass like this will make you almost completely invisible. Okay. Anytime you're around a fragment, you have to be very careful for robots. Looking for the smoke? I don't see it. But it's very close. Stay in the grass. Stay in the cover. Oh. That beep, I think, means that they detected you. Or they suspect you. I didn't even hear it. I heard the beep, but I didn't even hear it walking or anything. Where is it? It's coming. Come on. Where are you? Alright, let me take a sip of my tea and ponder. Alright, it looks like this foliage that I was in before does not really block you. Or conceal you as well as tall grass. Because my visibility meter was... It was surprisingly high, even when I was inside of that stuff. I'm going to take a peek. Oh, yep, they are guarding it. Shit. And there doesn't appear to be any good cover around here. That I can see through. I mean, I can hide behind rocks, but it's tall grass that is ideal. Okay. This is dangerous. I'm not familiar enough with the AI to really understand how how they react. But I'm going to attempt to distract them. With what? Bottle or an alarm? She's a bottle. There's a pretty good chance... Oh shit! It spotted me. Did that bottle... I think the bottle breaking actually scared off the birds. Whoa, that is cool. Are they coming towards me or towards the bottle? That is the question. I can't tell. I think they're going towards the bottle. Oh, shit, are they coming back? Whoa. What was that noise? Oh, 
I'm hearing something in the water. Okay, shit. Um, I think I need to use the alarm. What else do I have? I have another bottle. Actually, wait, can I... Oh, I can't throw it. I need to drink it. Okay, let's drink it. Okay. <laughs> now... Now I'm drunk, but I have an empty bottle. That's wonderful. Oh my god. I, I need to wait. <laughs> I need to wait. I can't possibly do anything like this. Okay, it's getting better. There you go. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, go... this way. Good, good. Good, perfect. Oh, shit! Yep, they spotted me. Nope, bad, bad, bad. Run, run. They're turned to... Oh, God. This is a bad place to be. Actually, this is a very good place to be because they're right up there. I'm going in the water. Goodbye. By the way, from my very limited experience with this game, um, there's nasty things in the water. I want to get out, like, right now. You do not want to stay in the water. Trust me. Ooh, I see a boat. If I need to, I can go into the boat. They're going to spot me here. Yep, yep, looking right at me, looking right at me. They are coming. Ooh, I, I see smoke over there. I think that's another fragment. I'm going to grab it. I'm going to grab it, going to grab it. I think, I think I lost them, maybe. Yep, that's a fragment. Looks like there's no one guarding this yet. Good. Okay. I think I lost them. I did. Ooh. All right, so there's a boat to another biome, but I need to take this fragment back. Thing is... See, what I'm thinking is some of these fragments are so big... Like, am I going to have to... If I find a big fragment in one of the other biomes, am I going to have to boat myself back just to deliver it to the Standing Stone? Because that would be really difficult. I don't even know how to get back to the Standing Stone. Is there a map? I don't think there's a map, no. There isn't a map, is there? Wait, M for map, but I just pressed M and nothing happened. M. Oh, wait a minute! There's a compass! At the top of the screen, I never even noticed that. I literally didn't even notice there's a compass at the top of the screen. Durr. Okay, so the standing stone is there. Okay, well I have a huge fragment and it's taking up a bunch of inventory space, so let's make our way back and attempt to find any other fragments. And supplies, of course. It's a cabin in the woods. Well, it's not really the woods, but yeah. Delicious local stout. And dead rats and a bunch of skulls. Hmm. I think I'll go this way. Oh. oh, there's a dead robot there. There's another dead robot, one that looks like it's a different type. Alright, I'm safe from the balloon. Is 
Any fragments here? Nope. I want to loot those bodies because they probably have weapons on them and I'd really like a weapon. You have to be careful with weapons because if you shoot them, everyone in the vicinity is going to know where you are and will converge on your position. But they're still good to have. Alright, he's just going to stay there. I could attempt to use the trap. I suppose. Yeah, we need to experiment, because I don't know how a lot of these things work, and I'm never going to know if I'm too cautious to use them. So, let's attempt it. And in many ways, this game's actually really beautiful. Even though it's relatively low fidelity. Just sometimes it looks really good, like that sun. It's beautiful. Alright. He's not looking this way. Where's that balloon going? It's going away. No one in the vicinity. Nope. Okay. Now, I need to figure out how to use this. I could put the alarm on it. That's probably the best thing to do, actually. Five and four. Okay, let's try that. Let's put in an open batch. Okay. What if I click it? What is, what is this? Can I take it back? Oh! Are you serious? I just trapped myself on my own fucking trap. How... Shit. <laughs> How do I get out of here? Please don't look behind you, robot. Oh my god, do not look behind you or this will be the end of Anne. Okay. Oh shit! Oh shit. This is going to be the death of me. I'm going to die because I got stuck in a fucking trap that I set down. Good thing it's dark. They shouldn't be able to see me. I got hit, but I'm not bleeding. I can't see anything. I'm running through the weeds at night. That was so fucking stupid. <sighs> see, you need to test these things or you will never know. Alright, I'm running in the direction of the standing stone. This is what it's called, right? Standing stone? I don't hear them. I think I'm safe. I'm just gonna keep running. Okay. Ah. Splendid. But do be careful finding the next one. I will. <laughs> Thank you for telling me. Hmm, that's quite strange. When you use an item and put it into your quick slot bar, even after you use the item, it still stays in your quick slot. Like, I don't even have the, the trap anymore or the bottle. Okay, save. And let's see if we can find another one. Nope. Alright, just head in a different direction. Let's go this way. Why did the robot have to turn around? It never turned around before. Why did it turn around right then? I hear them. Wait, have I been here? I could check the name. If I don't get seen. Actually, let me loot this. Can't miss this opportunity. Oh, hello. Hello, moldy bread and dead rats. I... I was taken in by the cracked teapot, which looks very patriotic. But apparently does nothing. No, no, come on. Nothing this British can be useless. I'm taking it. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Much as I want to check the name, I don't want to die. 
Okay, question. Can they hear me? Yes, they can hear me. Oh god, this is bad. I'm gonna get shot. I was wondering if they could hear me, because it would make sense if they could. Obviously, they have ears. However, the game only gives you a visibility meter, not a sound meter. So I was thinking, maybe they can't. But no, they can. I sprinted, and uh, they definitely heard me. It's kind of weird, though. If they can hear, why isn't there a, a sound meter? Oh god. There's like three robots there. Okay. I'm going to a different biome. I'm leaving. Jesus. Is this dock long enough? <laughs> this is a really long dock. Ah. <sighs> okay. Farewell. This game's actually really atmospheric in some... at some points. Like right now, look at it, it looks just foggy. Like a foggy full moon night. And the birds. Okay, let's go. There are a number of islands in the archipelago. Each of them is likely to have fragments of the device for you to collect. Try not to get lost. Oh, I'm sure I won't get lost. There's no way I can get lost. I have such a good sense of space, you know. Alright, we're going north. I don't remember what biome is north, but we're about to find out. Here we go. Oh my. Well, this is definitely different looking. Mm, would this be the mountain biome? Looks kind of mountainous. Ooh, and there's a fragment. I shan't get too excited, though. Because becoming too excited might kill and trickle bank. And also, I can't go up this hill because it's too damn steep. Come on. Come on, Anne. You can do it, Anne. Alright, thankfully this is a small one. So I don't think I need to run back to... Uh, take it back to the center piece. Whoa, look at that. What is that? It's just standing out in the middle of nowhere. Looks like a gate to oblivion. And I wonder if there's a way up. Ooh. There's one actually quite close over here. Alright, I haven't seen any robots yet. Not yet. But they're around. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, that's a fire. Um, apparently, you can... Uh, if you have matches of some sort, you can light fires and cook meat. I think it'll tell me if I use it, right? I know you're not used to preparing your own meals, madam. But I'm sure you can master roasting game on an open fire. That smoke can be seen for miles, however, so do be quick. Right, so yeah, they will come to your position if you do that, apparently. You can cook wild game or raw meat. Not exactly sure where you're gonna find that. Can you... can you hunt? I haven't seen any animals. Maybe you can just find raw meat inside of homes? I'm not sure. I hear a robot. Somewhere. Faintly. Let me guess, it's in the direction of that. Yes, it is. Gotta be careful. We're in tall grass right now, so I'm okay. Okay. They're guarding it. Alright. What do I have for distraction? An alarm clock, uh, alarm clock, and a delicious local stout. I really want to figure out how to use... 
throwing bottles. So, and I need vitality, so let's drink this. It's gonna make me drunk, I think. Is it? Oh. Apparently it's not. Okay, that's good. Right. I want to know how this works, so here we go. Okay, they went to it, but now they're just going back. Like, that doesn't really give me enough time. They're searching the area. I think I need to throw it further away if I can. Mm. I could use the alarm clock. There's three of them. Whoa! Okay, that's interesting. Those are the things I saw when I was talking about how you don't want to spend time in the water because those things seem to randomly come out of it. I'm not sure why it's coming out now, though. Shit! Shit! What are you doing? Fuck! It didn't even see me. I'm just really unlucky and it came right in my direction. Oh god, I hear another one. Somewhere. Actually, this might allow me to get the fragment. Screw it, I'm getting the fragment. Fuck you, robots, I'm getting the fucking fragment! Ooh, that's close, that's, that's really close. Oh god, this is dangerous, ow. And let's go. Um, I think I should return and return these. Yes, I'm gonna go back on the boat and return these two fragments. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute, there's another one. I see smoke. Oh god, there's more. Oh no. Okay, they're not coming after him anymore. Alright, um... Maybe I should try the alarm clock now. I'm getting rid of this junk, I'm sorry. I, I can't spare it. Alright, sun's coming up. Alright, someone just spotted me a little bit. They're suspicious. Oh, hello, Wisp. Please go away. You're lighting up my position. Alright, I'm not sure how far away they can hear. But I need to put it kind of far away. I'm hoping they can hear it from here. I'm gonna put it all the way over here. Okay, uh, that's four. Here we go. Okay. They can go out into the field, and I will be over here. Did they hear that? I can hear it. Slightly. I don't think they heard it. Shit. Well, at the moment, I'm terrible at distractions. I don't think any of my dis- No. No, none of my distractions have been effective. I threw bottles. That never worked. I never did it right. I just used an alarm as a delayed distraction device. But I put it too far away. I attempted to use a bear trap of some sort, but I got my own leg stuck in the bear trap. 
<sighs> it's not looking too good for Anne Tricklebank. But she is alive. Should probably eat something, actually. Let's have a jar of marmalade. Hmm. I picked a bunch of pickled onions. Cool. So if I do get shot, I can heal up a bit. They're going to spot me instantly. Look at that. I need a distraction. No, I need stuff. I, I, I'm going to leave. There's no point. I need stuff. Let's go back to the boat. And then I have to decide, do I want to take these fragments back? Or do I want to push my luck and attempt to find supplies or another fragment? Before I go back. I want supplies. I really want supplies. Yeah, I'm going to go um, northwest this way. Ugh, my tea is lukewarm now. Disgusting. There's nothing less British than lukewarm tea. No fragments nearby. I really want supplies, though, so that's what I'm looking out for the most. Let's do a bit of scouting. Oh, shit. There's somewhere that way. But there's no fragment that way, so who cares? I'm going this way. I'm going to stay on the coast. Whoa. I've heard that the, uh, I hear shots. I've heard that the robots actually fight each other. I don't know if there's, like, different factions or whatever. That could be very good for me because I could go and pick from the bodies. But there's probably going to be some stragglers, so if I don't have a way to kill them or distract them, it's probably not worth it. But I'm going to check this out. Alright, they're coming from this direction. Whoa. Close. Man, why is my visibility so high? Look at what I'm in. I should be completely concealed. They're scaring off the birds. There's actually really advanced bird AI, I think. I'm pretty sure the AI in this game is actually very advanced in general. There's a lot of complex stuff going on behind the scenes that you might not notice immediately. Ooh, there's a building. Alright, this is dangerous. Wait a minute. Hold on. I just realized something. Maybe I can shoot the birds to get... to get meat. To cook. Do you think so? Maybe. What the hell's wrong with the birds? Looks like they're made out of the... the spray can and MS Paint. Maybe they're not even models. Maybe they're like sprites or something? I know there's gunshots around here, but look at that. I'm confused. What is that? Why does it look so weird? Okay, okay, focus. I need to make sure Anne Tricklebank survives. They're still shooting. Which is strange. You think they would have killed each other by now? Maybe they're just... Bad shots? I don't know. Look, oh, shit. Did you see me? I hear them everywhere, but I don't see them. Ooh, raw meat. It's coming. Alright, fuck it. I'm out of here. I have raw meat. I'm good. It's not worth it. There's too many of them. Ooh, another cabin. A red toadstool. Uh, 
Sure. Ooh, it actually improved my vitality. Cool. And <laughs> I'm dripping balls. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Very good for evading the enemy. Alright, I'm gonna push my luck. I'm gonna push my luck a bit more. And look for more. No fragments. I'm still pretty close to the boat, so I could always just run if I needed to. Ooh, little island. I could go out to it, but why? I don't see anything, and there doesn't appear to be a fragment on it. Hmm. I'm still a bit confused by the map thing. It says M is map, but pressing it brings up nothing. I'm guessing you have to find it or craft it. Or something like that. Alright, yeah, I've got enough inventory space even to hold one big fragment. So, I'm good. Hmm. I'm not seeing a lot of things on the coast. I think I need to go inland. Let's go northeast. Let's go knee. This game really is beautiful sometimes. Oh, look at that. Oh, the birds. That couldn't have been more perfect. The birds flying past as the sunset goes down. As, as the sunset goes down. What does that even mean? As the sun goes down, that is the definition of a sunset. As the sunset goes down, as opposed to when the sunset goes up? Oh. Well, that's a lucky find. Hello. Ah, it's a broken shotgun. Eat the mints. And we have a bunch of raw meat. I right, just stop. For God's sake, stop making noise. There. Now I'm going to discard this. And let's wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Can I fix it? Can I use it? No. Probably not. What? How the hell would you fix that? It looks like it blew up. No. Oh, heard one of those water things. Those things are creepy. I wanna get oh god, look at that. I wonder if you're finding more raw meat because this is the mountainous biome. Oh whoa. I wonder if the items you find are tailored to the biomes. Like maybe it's not just like different geography and different buildings, but maybe there's actually different gameplay opportunities. Like maybe mountainous regions have a lot of hunters, so there's a lot of raw meat. You have to cook it. Hmm. All right, let's go closer to the coast. I feel safer by the coast because it's easy to figure out exactly how to get back. Of course, I mean it's it's marked on my compass, but. I don't know, it just feels more comfortable. Oh, hello. How you doing, creepy robot arms from the deep? If those existed in real life, I would never, ever go swimming in the rest of, for the rest of my life. Ever. Nope. It'd be like... Newest invention from whatever, whatever corp. Gigantic robot arms in the water. And then next week, new study says the percentage of people that go swimming regularly has dropped by 99%. 
Alright, I'm getting the impression you really don't find much on the coast. Because I found basically nothing. Okay, I'm really pushing my luck here. But I really want to find something before I go back. Oh god, I almost fell in. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Alright, going inland. Is that a little... Ooh, that's Shaq. <laughs> Another toadstool. Let's eat it. Alright, now I'm going to be high again. And... There's three boots... Of all, oh my god, of all things, there's three boots. Not two, not four, but three. That has to be a joke, right? Alright, there's a building. Still no fragments. Let's cut this place out. Don't see anything, let's approach. Yeah, I still really need to learn how to use how to use distraction effectively. I really don't know yet, but I need to keep experimenting with it because if I don't experiment, I will just well, I'll never know. It might get me killed, but I need to know, so I need to keep experimenting. Shit. They're nearby. That wisp just went through the building. Okay. I need stuff. So I'm going to try to loot this. Where's the door? Oh, is, that th is this the door? Who would build a house up against rocks? However, it's very convenient for me, so I'm not complaining because I'm perfectly safe here. <laughs> Moldy bread and piles of bones and dead rats. Okay, wonderful. Let's go to the other building I saw. And let's not sprint, because they will hear me. Oh god. Whoa. Oh my. What are they shooting at? Oh yeah, they're fighting others. Look at them all. And the cool thing about that is that all of this is just like emergent... I don't know what the right term is. Emergent AI reactions? Like, none of this is scripted. It just happens. Alright, that's way, way too much of a hot zone. However, I think they might have killed them? Oh, what's that one doing? If they killed them, I want to go in to loot the bodies. But there seems to be a straggler. Could approach from up on the hill. Yeah, I'm gonna scout it out. I think it's worth it. Gonna gonna go up to the hill and look down. If there are a bunch of bodies, then I am going to pick uh, pick their loot from them. Pick them clean. That's what I meant to say. I still need to worry about that straggler, though. I don't know what he's doing. Let's crouch down. Nice and slow. Take a sip of tea. Take it calm. Okay. Okay, I'm not this patient. Okay. Being on top of a rock is not good cover.
Whoa. All right, I don't see the straggler. Whoops. Now, what about bodies? Any... Any robot bodies? I think it'd be easier to hear them than see them in the dark. So... Yeah, I don't think I could see them in the grass. So I'm just going to go down. Oh, I hope this doesn't break my legs. I, I shouldn't even be able to walk on this. What, what am I doing? I'm stuck to the wall. But I'm not complaining. Alright, I think that was a straggler that just went back. Alright, keep an ear... Keep a... Listening for them. Any bodies? I hope they managed to kill some. It's a hell of a lot of ineffective shots if they didn't. I don't think they did. Hmm. And it's coming back, of course. Screw you, you pipe smoking robot. Here, I'm going to insult his honor with a very British insult. Your mom is so nice that I would love to sit down with her and have tea and have a chat. Yeah, that'll show him. All right, I'm sprinting to the front door. I, I just, oh shit, seriously? I thought I was out of sight. Don't care, I'm gonna loot it. Wait, where's the door? Where's the door? Oh my fucking god. Oh no. Shit. I think a hunting party just came back. <gasps> no, 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 no. I hope that's a rival faction actually. Maybe they'll shoot each other. I am staying right here. I have no visibility. Do I have anything on me that I could, like, throw? No. I have literally no distractions. Um, I'm actually hungry. I'm gonna eat that. Oh, whoa, whatever age just gave me max vitality. Holy crap. If they start shooting, I'm dead. Don't move. Don't move. Hold your breath and trickle bank. Hold your breath. Go, go away, Wisp! Jesus! Okay, are they enemies of that... I think I'm safe. Are they enemies of that one? Over by the church. Because if they are, there's about to be a shootout. I think I'm okay. Yeah. I really want to loot this damn place. Let me take a look over here. Nope. Still looking out. Alright. I'm just going this way. It's too dangerous. If I catch that one's attention, all the other four are coming for me. Oh, whoa. Is there... Is that a fragment, or is that a fire? No, it can't be a fragment. There's a building down there. They appear... Are they drinking tea? They're drinking tea. Oh, uh, what was that robot holding? It was holding something that looked like a head. A human head or something. Oh, God. Wait, wait, this is good. This is good. I can slip by them and get to the building. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. Alright, good. You really are being hunted. These things are good. Good. 
Nice and slow. Don't stand up. Okay, I think I can stand up now. Whoa. Wait. There's more down there. No fragments. <laughs> I think it just said, these new taxes are outrageous. Okay, good. Leave. What is it that's smoking? It can't be a fragment. Oh, God. I think it is a fragment, actually. I don't, I don't know why this isn't picking it up, but... They appear to be guarding it, and there's a wisp here, even. Oh, shit! I thought it was better hidden. I'm not. By the way, I think you just heard a woof woof. That is a robot dog. They exist. They are a thing. Alright, I... God, I just want to find something. It's so hard. They're guarding everything. Everything I want, they're guarding the bastards. Look. They're even guarding this. I hear them. Oh no, is it getting foggy? It's kind of foggy. I can't... I can't get to them. I don't have a weapon, and I don't have any distractions. And I think they just saw me. Running, running, we go again. I'm doing very poorly. But... I haven't really taken much damage. What the hell? What is... What? How can I... A sharp stone. Okay. Uh, and an apple. How am I looting this? What is this? Oh. I don't even know where the hell it is, but I'm running. Because it just shot me. Or, well, shot at me. Wait, are they even shooting me? I'm not sure if they're even shooting me. No. No, they're shooting each other. Okay, hold on. Take a little break here in the shadows. Okay, have a sip of tea. Mmm. And what did I just grab? An apple, which is usable. That thing looks like it's a month old. Looks like it's all shriveled. Let's eat it. Mm, Ten vitality, not bad. Alright, a sharp stone. What do I do with that? Small stones, distract bots, and scare birds with these. Scare birds. Mmm, but... Can you use birds as a distraction? By scaring them off, you'll distract the bots? I don't know. I need to experiment, though. Alright, we're gonna try to use this at some point. For something. Alright, I'm thinking my detector might just be, like, ineffective for some reason. Because I'm pretty sure those places had stones, or fragments, but it just wasn't working. Ooh, I actually have a really good vantage point up here. Let's take a look around. These are strangely pillar-shaped rocks. Look at this. These formations are unnatural. Okay. House over there? That's not the first house, is it? The one... That actually might be the first place I visited in the dock is over there, because that's the high thing, isn't it? That might be it. I'm not sure. I think there's another building... Uh, let's just go this way. Oh god! No, jump, jump up. Don't go that way. 
Let's go this way. Yes. I was about to fall from there to here. Don't break your foot, and trickle bank. Alright, how much food do I have left? Um, I just have this pumpkin. Which I think restores you pretty much to full vitality, but that's it. It'll last me a while, but it's really not enough to make me comfortable. And yes, that is actually the first formation. I recognize those two things, so let's not go that way. Come on. Need to get something. I've just been getting shot at and wasting my food. I haven't gotten anything for like the past 30 minutes. Oh. Okay. Wait, isn't that towards the water? Okay, it's gotta be on an island. I do not want to go into the water, that is for sure. Not unless it's a short distance. Alright, somewhere over there. Oh. It's there. It's, it's on a tiny nib of an island. Shit. Hmm. That does not even remotely seem worth it. I don't think you need every fragment from every island because you need, what, 25 in total? And I believe there's eight on each island. And there's five islands, so... Yeah, you don't need them all, I don't think. No. J just no. I'm not going for that. Ooh, hello, birds. Whoa. Sudden change of direction. Oh. Okay, I'm probably going to totally fail with the stone because I don't know how it works exactly, but let's try it. That is totally a fragment, or a fire, I guess. Okay, I can scare birds. Can you even see the birds roosting in the trees, though? Or are they just, like, assumed to be everywhere in the trees? I don't know. I've, I've never actually seen birds in the trees. I've seen them fly out of the trees. Is that a fragment? No, actually, that is a fireplace. Hmm. Is it worth it just to try to loot that place? Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, what the hell. Alright, let's see if this works. I'm going to throw... Uh, I don't know how far it goes. Let me just try doing this. Oh, wow, that's pretty far. Ooh, ooh, birds just... Yeah, okay. Now, did it work? That did fuck all. <laughs> and there's the robo dog. <laughs> okay, I don't know why you would want to scare birds. Maybe they just need to be closer? I, I, that was pretty close. It's within 50 feet. I don't know. I don't get how the distraction works in this game. And I have nothing else, right? Yeah. I need food. I could maybe loot the building? Like right now I could I could loot it, but it's way too freaking risky. All 
Especially with that robo dog. Kind of being separate from the group. Because I could just make sure I'm on the opposite side of the group on the building, but if that robo dog separates from the group, that would not work. Nah. Nope. You know what? We're going to lead them on a merry chase. Hey, guys! Come shoot it, Anne Tricklebank! Please? Please? Hello? Okay, so when I want them to see me, they don't. Come on! There we go. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Shoot at me. I'm not getting any closer. Shoot at me. Yes. Yes, yes. Lead them away. Yeah, come for me. Wait, is the dog... I don't think the dog's coming. That's not good. Lead them through the thicket. And go to the side. Using not so much distraction as diversionary tactics. Is that the same thing? Kind of sounds like the same thing. I don't really know. Okay, let's see if that works. I think the dog is still here, though. Oh, are they already coming back? Fuck. I'm just going to try to loot it. Yep, he just said these new taxes are outrageous. Okay. Very low visibility. I think the door... Oh, hello, doggy. I think the door is on the front. Probably. I think it's a safe bet that doors on a house would be on the front. Alright, come on, come on. Alright, so diversionary tactics do not work too well. Maybe you just need to lead them on the chase further. Rather than just straight up running away. Okay, okay, this might work, this might work. Fucking dog! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, shit! Fuck! Okay, I'm going home. Screw this. I'm going to the boat. Ooh, those shots are landing close. Yeah, if, if you keep their attention for longer rather than just straight up running away like I am, you might, maybe that would work, but I am going home. My vitality is almost completely gone. I need to find stuff. Whoa. This is not the way I want to take. I need to eat my pumpkin before I take off on the boat. Alright, we're pretty much home at this point. Yep, I remember this. I do not have any matches. I need a matchbook or a match box, I think. To light this, and yeah, I have neither. Say, I don't suppose this weird pillar thing has a door. That wouldn't make any damn sense, but let's check. Do you have a door, pillar? To the gates of oblivion, or whatever you are? No, you don't.
I could see if these robots have left. Let's eat this. Okay, max vitality. Now I'm going to starve if I don't find more food. I want this fucking fragment. I want it. I could get it right now if they don't turn around. And of course they turn around. I'm gonna get this fragment. Come on, hunt me, hunt me. Just don't, don't hit me. Yeah, I'm right here, I'm out in the open. I'm jumping. Ow, shit, I'm bleeding. I would advocate discretion, madam. It might be best to run and hide, but if you have found a weapon, perhaps you can use it to fend them off. Oh, I'm getting that fragment. Right now. That is my fragment, you assholes. Oh, shit. This is... No, am I bleeding again? This is not good. This is a bad tactic. Do never do this. I've bled like twice already. Or is it three times? I don't know. I need to go. I need to go. Oh god, I don't want to go in the water. I do not want to be in the water, but nothing else makes any sense. If those things pop out, I'm dead. Straight up, I'm dead. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, fuck! Shit. Fuck. They're right above me. Are they going to pop out again if I go over there? Because I can get to land very quickly. I think they're going to pop out if I go over there. Oh shit! Okay, we're going. We're going. Oh god. They can reach. <laughs> Fuck. <sighs> you appear to be dead. And Drickle Bank! Why? <laughs> uh, uh. One hour, 15 minutes. Zero robots slain. Three bandages used. 13 foods eaten. Zero shots fired. Zero traps sprung. Well, that's not quite true. I did... <laughs> I sprung my own trap on my own foot. Zero animals cooked. Zero tea drunk. One time died. There ends the sad story of Anne Tricklebank. Incompetent survivor. A person who trapped her own foot in her own trap. Who threw bottles to no good effect. Who got seen more times than even a 20-foot cyclops would have been seen. Just, she wasn't good. But what did, what did Anne learn? Um, she learned that she doesn't know how the hell to use distractions, and she still doesn't, so she hasn't learned all that much, really. Um, she learned that it's a bad idea to run to fragments, in general, because you'll get your ass shot off, and then you'll get your ass, um, torn apart by, uh, some gigantic robot thing in the water. Also, um, she learned to stay out of the water. Although, in truth, she didn't learn any of these things because she's dead. Or rather, she learned them right before her death and was never never able to put them into action. So, that was the life of Anne Tricklebank. Exit to menu. Anne, your world has to go. I'm sorry, Anne. That's it. Delete world. <sighs> Farewell, Anne Tricklebank.